Okay guys, I'm back in Speed Drifters. Got enough Speed Drifters eh? There's a new Speed Pass Season 26 Beach Party But the car doesn't look like it is part of the Speed Pass eh? Yeah, this is the Summer Speed Pass Except the car is not Midsummer Sweetheart, it's Polar Shadow Star Okay uh, You don't see the effects if you set it on low visual If you put high then you can see it there's like blue uh, blue spikes around it but you can see it when it's uh, in, in game lah, okay? so yeah Polar Shadow Star characteristic when overtaking or being overtaken there's an 80% chance that you get 4% and tank per second within 7.5 seconds and Nitro Max Speed plus 7km per hour there's a cooldown for 3 seconds at the start So it won't activate for the first 3 seconds eh? So yeah, this is a speed pass car as predicted <laughs> it, it is originally a workshop diamond eh? Workshop diamond car It became a speed pass car So full mod is middle, left, left and left Let's test this car Just uh, you know this is still not permanent So there is no garage path eh? Normal speed is 202.4 Double boost 246.2 CWW 311.6 That's already fast eh? WCW 294.1 WCW 300 No, it cannot be Ah, 316 <laughs> So by speed, this is very fast compared to other certain cars eh? Because this is originally a workshop uh, diamond car So it has fast CW, uh, fast speed uh, basically But its characteristic is on overtaking eh? So it's better to play this when you are in battling, not playing solo So it's better to play in rank eh? Today is Monday, so I cannot play Bounty. I'll just play normal solo speed then. Okay. Any map will do, eh? It doesn't matter if it's a long map, short map, jumping, or whatever. Ah, great one. Battling 3 ISO. Great. Speed pass versus meta car. Let's see. Activated already And again And again When you activate it lasts for 7 seconds eh? Oh activated again Oh yeah Even though it's fast, it's a bit heavy. Ah, I lost this one. Yeah, it's a bit heavy to uh, turn and drift. So I won't say it is recommended on the maps like Great Wall. Let's see if we can do better on another map. Foggy Maple Grove, this is continuous map. Continuous and also long, okay. Let's give this a try. And there's another person using Pol Polar Shadow Star. 3 ISO, 1 Starlight. Or Brilliant, whichever you want to call it. Why does it look different here? It looks more white. 
silver, more white and silver color compared to mine. <laughs> uh, extra one point. Okay, activated ready. second this time for this map okay but a bit better but not for the continuous part eh? <laughs> not much turning actually helps okay one more game we got just now a short map and we got a continuous map now what kind of continuous but a lot of turning as well okay usually when there's a lot of of turnings you can overtake but too many turnings uh, a bit of a problem and this is a four player two ice soul What the hell? Okay, I'm losing this already. I love it. Not going well this time. Okay. Come back maybe? Ah. Never mind. Ah, still lost. Okay. Uh, I can conclude already actually. It is fast, but Turning and drifting isn't strong, and Enteng also not strong. Well, it did go a bit well when I played <laughs> on stream yesterday, but today, guess not. Alright, so I can just conclude this. It's not really that uh, great of a speed pass, but it is originally Workshop Diamond. That's, uh, that's the one thing that it's uh, good to buy, this speed pass car. 
And this is the first ever overtaking or being overtaken speed pass car. So far, we don't have any speed pass car that is a characteristic overtaking or being overtaken. And I said, if this is an if this is a speed pass car, this will be the first one. And yes, it is. This is the first speed pass car that is a overtaking or being overtaken kind of characteristic. So yeah, it's good only for speed. It is it's speed and also it's better when you are battling someone or maybe battle your own retail or something because that's when the characteristic will activate more but uh, overall use, uh, use using wise I don't really want to use it because uh, the drifting and turning doesn't feel strong and uh, the end tank also isn't, doesn't feel that strong to collect uh, the charge time it's not really that good of a charge time even though its characteristic does increase its end tank I guess Four speed pass is alright. Okay, if if this was also a workshop uh, diamond just like in QQ, definitely not worth getting. <laughs> and the speed pass also uh, summer speed pass season. Eh? All the summer stuff except the car is not. <laughs> it doesn't uh, make sense. But wait, what is the end of the speed pass? Okay, so. This new speed pass, because Polar Shadow Star has no skin, there is nothing at 120, 150. Yeah, 180 is so don't have, right? So this speed pass really, uh, how to say, you don't really need to buy any extra levels for any extra stuff at the end. Because there's nothing at the end. There's only extra, uh, this, this glory coin only. So there's no reason to go above 120 even. You can just stop at 100 and that's it. Because 100 is the car, the Polar Shadow Star. And you get the B car summer ice cream eh, when you reach level 100. So uh, how do I say this? This speed pass is like a bit, <laughs> a bit low value now suddenly. I'll still buy it though because of the, all the other stuff that I want to get. Okay. But yeah, I think they kind of <laughs> lower the value of the speed pass now since there's nothing at the end. Well, it's easy to complete the speed pass this time. Um, 18 levels per week, 72 for all, all 4 weeks. Plus, you can probably clear this easily, there's another 60 levels, so yeah, it's very easy. So don't even need to worry if you don't complete the speed pass stuff because you can you only need to reach level 100 you don't even need to go 150 so okay i think uh, that's it for speed pass season 26 polar shadow star why they call it polar shadow star when i call it polar star not uh whatever yeah that's it for this video guys thank you guys for watching see you guys next time